Hi, it's Lana with Fast Fit Foods, and today I'm going to teach you how to work your biceps and your triceps. Especially for us ladies, these biceps, especially our triceps, sometimes get that jiggly and that little bit of fat buildup behind here. So, I'm going to teach you how to tone that up. This is great for men too. You can adjust your weight to what your body needs are. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is a bicep curl. So you take your dumbbell weights, stand with your feet about hip width apart, stand up nice and straight, and bring one up at a time. One, down, all the way down. One, all the way down. Two, two, three. Three. You want to always do proper form too. Proper form is very important. It's more important than the amount of repetitions that you can do. Four. Four. Five. Five. Six. Six. Seven. Seven. Eight, eight, nine, nine, ten, ten. You always want to make sure that you do the same amount on both sides. That's very important with the same weight. These can also be done seated. If you have trouble standing, you can still have strong arms. You can sit and work your muscles the same way. I want you to do three sets of 10 repetitions. You can take a break in between these sets. If you can't make it to three sets of 10 repetitions, then make it until failure, until your muscles are fatigued that you can no longer do this. Sometimes you're a beginner, you may be advanced, so adjust the workout according to what you need. Our next exercise will be showing how to work our tricep. There's three heads to our tricep, and we're going to work all three heads today. So first we're going to stand and almost in a, a skier stance with your knees slightly bent, feet hip width apart, and we're going to stand just like this, head down, and keep your back straight, and bring your arms back. Extend them all the way back and slightly squeeze and hold that tricep muscle. So we're going to do up to 10 repetitions. Two. Three, always keeping proper form. That's most important, proper form. Four. Five. Six. Seven. You're also working your shoulders while you're doing this too. Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay, that was great. Now an alternative to having dumbbells, if you don't have any dumbbells, some people don't, you can also use something you have around your house. So such as you can use um, a milk container, water jugs with handles. You can fill them up with enough water until the weight feels well that you can make it to at least 10 repetitions. Or you can use something simple, which is what I have. This is just a can of tomato sauce. It's 28 ounces which is a little over a pound. So, we're going to do the same thing. You just stand, hold the can in your hand, and lift and curl. Lift and curl. And then when you're done, switch sides. Stand, feet hip width apart, lift and curl. And again, these can be done while you're sitting down. And make sure the arm goes all the way up to almost touching the shoulder, and all the way back down. Same thing with our triceps. The same stance, skier stance I call it. Head straight, almost looking down. Back, perfectly aligned straight, and the same thing. Bring that can back, tight grip on the hand, and bring the can back. And again, side angle, we'll do this side so you can see. Bring the can back. 
And again, I want you to try to do three sets of 10 repetitions or until failure, until you can no longer do this. This is a great workout for men or women, beginners or advanced. It's all up to you. But you'll have great arms. Everyone will ask, what are you doing? And it's very simple. Thank you again, and I'll see you on the next one. There's many more exercises I'm going to teach you how to do with these dumbbells. And we'll do one last time. See, you can have great arms like this in a short amount of time. Very easy. Thank you again, and have a good one.